Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy Zeke, the Crypto Miner, and as school is about to get back into session, and a lot of you guys going off to college, I'm going to give you the top five ways to save money while you're in college. Let's get into it. All right, so number five, the number five way to save money while in college is do not buy brand new books. If you're going to offer up Amazon, eBay, you can buy a lot of your professor books through second uh, hand auctions and stuff like that. If you're buying them brand new, books could be anywhere from $120 to $200. If you're buying them used, it's the exact same book, exact same material, and you can get it for up to 50 to 75% off. Also, on the same topic, once you finish with that class, as a college graduate, once I finish taking a class, I have never ever, once in my life, used that book again. So don't try to save the book and don't try to return the book to the bookstore and get it for full value because they're gonna give you maybe 10% of what you pay for it. So instead of, instead of selling it back to the bookstore, what you wanna do is you know, offer up Craigslist, eBay, Amazon, and sell your books back to uh, another person that's trying to uh, buy it next year or during the next semester, you just post bulletin boards on the school website or you just post them inside the dorm rooms on kids that's taking that class next semester and you'll be able to sell your books that way for an even bigger profit. So that's the number five way to save money while in college. All right, now coming to the number four way to save money while in college is to actually do not buy cable, okay? Now, if you're living on the dorm rooms and your dorm have cable, fine, but if you're moving off campus and you're thinking about getting a cable package to watch TV, don't get it. You can get your internet package for around $30 to $40 a month. One roommate buy Hulu and the other roommate buy Netflix. And, and with YouTube combined, you guys subscribe to the channel. Subscribe to the channel. With YouTube combined, you guys can pretty much watch any TV show in our movie available out there. And you're already in college, so you don't need to be in the house cooped up watching TV shows out there all day. You need to go out there and enjoy your college life. But you do not need to spend $100 to $150 a month on cable when you could just spend $7.99 on Hulu and $12.99 for Netflix and be between the two roommates you guys could split that up over the uh, internet package but yeah that's the number four way to save money while in college all right that brings us to number three the number three way to save money while in college is to it's gonna be a surprise is to actually cook your food and don't go out to eat every single day for fast food for breakfast lunch and dinner okay if you spend on average of seven dollars for breakfast lunch and dinner for each one that's around 21 dollars a day okay let's just round that to 20. if you spend 20 every single day okay 20 times seven days that's 140 dollars a week and if you do that for a month you're going to spend a total of 560 dollars in a month on fast food if you don't learn how to cook your freshman year okay so guys learn how to cook now if you go to the grocery store and, and spend 250 bucks on groceries for the month or groceries that could carry over for the rest of the school year cereal steak anything that you want to eat or even bump the ante up to $300 a month you will still save over 200 300 dollars just by cooking instead of eating fast food every single day so that's the number three way to save money while in college all right, that brings us to number two. The second way, the second best way to save money while in college is to, believe it or not, grab your student ID and use your student discounts, especially for back to school shopping. Apple runs a program where they discount their laptops up to 100, almost $200 off their brand new laptop if you have a student ID. You can also go to H&M and Zara and they also have student discounts when you show your student ID. So you can write something on your hand whenever you go out to say, hey, remind me to show my student ID because there are a lot of stores out there that actually discount students for showing that student ID. Uh, one mistake that I made, I, I lost my ID in college and I never cared about replacing it, so I never got my student discount. But I'm passing this knowledge down to y'all so that when you're out shopping, buying food, buying electronics, buying furniture, just try to use your student ID wherever you go. You never know, it might actually be a student discount waiting for you. And that's the number two way to save money while in college. All right, and that brings us to number one, the one that you guys all been waiting for, the best way to save money while in college. And not only will it only save you money, but it will actually make you money. 
That's right, I said it'll make you money. But before I get back into the number one reason, you guys gotta go down, hit the thumbs up button, and subscribe, and I'll tell you what the number one way is to save money while in college. All right, now that you guys liked and subscribed, I'm gonna go ahead and tell you what it is. The best way to save and make money while in college is to actually use what you're learning in college. If you're going to college to be a photographer, start an Instagram and start posting pictures to, to blow up and, and, and promote your page that way. Start a YouTube channel. If you're going to college to be a sound engineer, start making beats and sell them on SoundCloud. If you're going to college to be an artist, sign up on OfferUp and start painting picture portraits on offer up not only that it's going to add up over time but starting early in college you never know you could blow up to where it can actually become your full-time job and you guys make a lot of money if you're in college for PR and you want to get in front of a camera to learn how to speak in public and in front of the camera start a YouTube channel and you guys will start making money that way so if you're in college learn everything you can while in college Learn your majors, learn your profession, learn your trade, and actually start using that trade to start to make money while in college. So you don't have to wait until after you graduate to get some actual experience using your trade. So that is the number one way to make money while you're in college. Go ahead and subscribe to the channel. This is your boy Zeke the Crypto Miner. Check out these other videos that's probably going to be right there or over here. They're going to be somewhere. But yeah, subscribe, like, there's going to be more videos to come. This is the back to school, how to, the top five ways to save money while in college. And this is your boy Zeke the Crypto Miner, and I'm out.